Howdy, people! Zar Thwomp here, and welcome to episode 33 of Donkey Kong 64. Last time, we completed everything that was left to complete in Crystal Caves. We defeated Army Dillaware rematch, and we killed him. And then we returned to the DK Isles and knocked out some golden bananas. And though, speaking of which, there's something that we need to do. There's something that we need to do with Chunky, because I just realized this. Apparently, we did not get Chunky. We did not get the Arena Banana. And I think I know why. I think I know why. Because with Chunky, we did not go back to Snide's lab. Remember back when we were in Gloomy Galleon, and we got his, and we got his Banana Blueprint from the... And we got his... And we got the Deca Isles Banana Blueprint from... Eh, we got it from Snide and Gloomy Galleon along with its Golden Banana. So, naturally, we didn't get back to the lab. And, well, I thought that we got the banana. Okay, so anyways, let's get going. We'll head up there. We'll get that battle crown. And then, from there, we just... And then from there, we can move on with our goal. Because, well, we got something special in this episode. Backtracking to Fungi Forest to get one last golden banana with Lanky. Okay, we could have just warped up here. We could have just warped you. We didn't have to take the long way. If we fall down. We're taking the we're taking the warp. Okay. Okay, it's over. Wait. It it can't be. It can't be. You got to be serious. You got to be kidding me. It was right here. It was right here. I could have sworn we got it. Okay, maybe it's the Fungi Force one? I don't know. I, I could have sworn we got it. Oh, maybe it's in the actual hub? But really, what? What? I could have sworn we got, I could have sworn we forgot about it. But well, we have one of the Battle Crowns, but we don't have the other. Okay, if if we can't find it, then it looks like we're gonna have to we're gonna have to I'm gonna have to go nuclear and just search through all the all the videos and see what we're missing. That or basically towards the end of the game, just cut, do start an episode off just right in front of the arena. Okay, let's go. Let's see if it's in here. Nope, I am not finding it. Okay, looks like we're going to have to do things the hard way. Okay, but for now, let's head back to Fungi Forest. Okay. Let's see. Okay, yes, right there. Okay, if the mushrooms aren't there, then we're kind of screwed in terms of battle arenas. I could have sworn we went to the battle arena here. The mushroom's no longer here. The mushroom is no longer here. The mushroom is no longer here. Wait, is that a chunky pad? You have to turn invisible for it! Oh, did we even not go to the arena? Forest Fracas. Okay, we found it. I'm not complaining. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, boom. Okay. Boom. Okay, take them all out. Hey, but at least we found it. At least we found it. Did we turn, need to turn invisible to find it? Or was it just always there? Or maybe it caused the chunky barrel to appear. Okay, I think I see what it is. I think I see what it is. Okay. 
No! Okay, there. Okay, well played. Final battle crown for DK Isles. Okay, we got it. Any other mysteries? Nope. Let's destroy, yeah, let's destroy Chunky's DNA by just going into a tag row while invisible. And then Chunky comes out, just fused to another Kong. He's fused to Lanky. Just they become this abomination. Okay, but anyways. Let's go, because we have one last golden banana here. Okay, let's go purple. I believe it's the purple one. It was near the mushroom, but still. We have to go, we, you can't do this banana on your first trip. Trust me, you cannot. You try to do it, it's impossible. It's like the beetle race. You think, oh, hey, we could potentially do it. We could potentially do it if we just move fast enough. No, no, no. It's not like that. It's not like that at all. And we could have just used teleport number five. Okay. But anyways, let's head on down here. Yeah, here's the enemies in this section during the day. And before you ask, yes, you have to do this during the day. You can't do this at night. The rabbit doesn't come out at night, just like how the owl doesn't come, wake up during the day. Plus, this area looks a little better during the day, if I do say so myself. Anyways, we're going to need some crystal coconuts. Because, well, we're going to need that speed barrel. We're going to need it. We could have taken teleport number four here. We could have taken teleport number four and saved a few seconds. Anyways, welcome to hell. If only we could have blown this guy up earlier. If we could have blown that rabbit up, things would have been better. Okay, 36. Okay, there we go. You want as many crystal coconuts for this section as possible, you know, in case you need to retry. But we do will not need to retry because we will have restore points. Anyways, let's go wake up the rabbit. Wake the sleeping giant. Yan, hey Lanky, I've heard you're a bit of a mover. How about a good old fashioned running race around my obstacle course? First back here wins the trophy. Anyways, this is not the challenge I was talking about. Granted, this rabbit can give you a bit of a can be a bit of a pain in the ass. Hey, look at him, he's running backwards. Just the absolute arrogance on this rabbit. The absolute arrogance. But oh, trust me, he's going easy on us. He is ve going very easy on us right now. Okay, anyways, see that crusher over there? That crusher is your friend. And you want to know why? Because basically, that crusher will always be there. And the thing is, sometimes he can interrupt the rabbit's path. Meaning that the rabbit can get stuck on him and can throw off the race. Which can make things easier to win for you. Anyways, get used to the track here. Because we are going to need to run it again, but even faster. If only the race here was this. If only the if only this was the only race. If this was the only race, it would not be bad. It would actually be pretty, it would actually be pretty reasonable and fun. But no. <laughs> Not bad for a lumber and ape. I wasn't really trying, so you can hand out the trophy yet. But I need to get my breath back before we race for the big one. So take this consolation prize, and I'll see you later. Those coins are an insult. Anyways, let's do this. Okay, thankfully I know of a trick for this one. I'm ready for you this time, Lanky. Make it two out of two, and I'll hand over my trophy. Okay, anyways, for this one, we are not going to race him, because notice how we have to go in this barrel. Now, stand under the barrel and wait. Just wait for him. Trust me, we are going to want to wait for him. Okay. Now, you may think, Wait, why are you losing the race intentionally? 
Well, basically, the game has is rigged in this race. And I mean, it's outright rigged. It's not, oh, it's the reaction time's too fast. No, the game is purposely working against you here because you go in that barrel, the animation takes longer than normal, and the rabbit still runs while you're in the animation. So the only thing that would make it worse is if this was your first instance of using the speed, the orangutan sprint barrel and just Squawk was giving you a tutorial. But anyways, you're going to pretty much lose this race every time as a result. Now, wait for the rabbit to cross the finish line. And don't speed up the text. Man, that was so funny. My grandpa could run faster than you. What is it with everyone and their grandpa? Anyways, jump in the barrel. Now, we are going to want to restore points. If you hear the sound go off, you know you've done this right. Now, we're going to want to do this because in this state, look at this. I may be at this time, Lanky. Make it. Okay. What? Okay, fine. We're doing it legit. We'll try it legit. I'll show you the legit way. And watch how I win legit. Okay. Restore point, restore point. Apparently I didn't do it right. Oh no, you can't speed through it. Or maybe you, or maybe it just, the glitch worked against me. Okay. Okay, we're gonna do this. Okay, let's try this glitch again, because the glitch worked for me. I know the glitch works. I am aware of the glitch. Okay, this is gonna be the episode, is it? Just Zarthwam versus the rabbit. Okay, but really, this rabbit is the worst mission, because basically this is the only mission in the game where you have to actually cheat to win. Because basically, if the game started you off in this position, fine. If the game started you off with the barrel, that would be great. That yeah, would give you a chance. But basically, but you have to cheat just to give yourself an even odds of winning. That is not good. Okay. Okay, apparently we failed the glitch. Oh no, it's before he crosses the finish line, I believe. Okay, let's try that again, shall we? Okay, wait for it. Okay. I know it's at some moment. Okay, let's do this. I'm showing you how this happens. We are not skipping. You know why? Because if I'm suffering like this, so are you. It's basically, if I'm going down, you're going down with me. Okay. Okay, there, I think that did it. Okay, it is right before that then. Did they did they put a patch out for the game? Since the last I played this? You know what? Screw it. We're doing this. And then you get the grenade B, the grenade zinger. No! Actually, screw it. Screw it. Low restore point. I could have I got that one time, though. Okay, I guess I, I just had to wait a second more. No, you have to be right in the barrel when the game or scene happens. I'm remembering it now. I'm remembering it. Yeah, this could take a little bit of setup. But still, you think, oh, I could potentially win this. No. 
it's you saw how that rabbit was. You saw how that rabbit was. This is the one banana that I think just screws everyone over. Just really. Make it where the rabbit is. Why couldn't they make it with just the one race? Why did they have to make it an orangutan sprint barrel? Seriously, that's this is the reason why I'm not a big fan of lanky sprint power, because the game overestimates it. The game thinks that's this end-all be-all of power. Yeah, okay, let's see if this works. Let's see if this works. That darn rabbit. Freaking kill the wabbit! Kill the wabbit! <laughs> Don't speed it up. Don't speed it up. Okay, I think I got it. I think I got it. Create. Okay. I think this is it. There! There we go. We got the glitch working. We got the exploit. This is a feature. Now we have a fair race. But even now, it's still a challenge. If you fail, guess what? You're going, you're still going to lose. You're going to lose if you miss one thing even slightly. Okay. Go, 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 go. Stick around, stick around. Come on, get stuck. No, I got stuck on him. Look at this. Yeah, yeah, boy. Yeah, the original. Yeah, boy. Okay, good. Go, 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 go. Stick in front of him. Stick in front of him. Yes! <laughs> we, you saw one me monkey moving, Lanky. I'll hand you that trophy. Better hand me that trophy. Hand us the trophy! Oh, but there you go. That's the thing. The glitch is very finicky. We're basically, with the glitch, you have to util you have to basically, ju you have to be in the barrel when the screen transitions. If you break out of the barrel, it will basically automatically cancel you out. Basically. Because I think it's just some in-between state where the game is like, oh, hey, you're in the barrel. As such, just prioritize putting you in the state to just put you in the orangutan sprint. But yeah, you have to do that glitch if you want to reliably win this race. Just, you saw how close it was even with the glitch. Imagine we were trying to do that without. As such, just when you're doing this without the glitch, the only way you can reliably win this race is if on the off chance, he gets stuck on the crusher. Seriously, that is your only way to reliably win this race. Get him stuck on an enemy that may be walking by. That is not a fair challenge. That is not a fair challenge if I had to hope that basically an enemy just so happens to be walking by. That is not a fair challenge. That is not, okay? When it comes to challenges in video games, I am fine with a difficult section. Heck, Hollow Knight, yes, I was nervous with the White, with the white Palace. But basically, but the thing is this, I may, have been ner I may have been nervous with the White Palace, but I never once blamed it on the game because the game was relatively, was very fair with it. Same with the Tempest. Even though the Tempest was infuriating me beyond belief, I knew it was just a matter of the game trying to push me to the brink. Meanwhile, basically with this game, it's just the game's thinking to itself, you know what, we're just gonna make it all, we're just gonna make this challenge really hard for you. Just makes me wonder how the how the devs intended for you to beat that challenge, you know? Just makes you wonder. But anyways, with that done, we're off to our final world, our penultimate level. Okay, let's go. Glasses in the air. We don't even know where we're landing. Okay, I know that Diddy's cur that Diddy's Crusher is right around this area. Okay. Yeah, we still need to find ditties. And from the look of it, just... Oh, right, right, right. No, that's a... That's the lanky pad. Okay. Oh, right, yes, yes. We need Di we need Donkey Kong as coconut. I knew that ditties was in here. 
But still, I love this hub music. Okay. Donkey, you can come on out. Okay. Boom. Okay. There we go. Diddy time. And then we can make our way to the next level. And we can get a little bit, and we get a few things done. Okay. Let's jump over here. Lights are flashing in my den. Okay. And there we go. How many bananas did he have at Curiosity in this area? Four. Okay. We, we pretty much we completed Diddy for DK Isle. Now all it is is Chunky and Donkey. And their, and their final things are going to be in the final hub. Okay. So anyways, with that, let's go. Only 80 bananas here. Come on. I haven't got all day. Show me the bananas and I'm out of this dump. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Must get out of here before Fatso is... Fatso is recovering the boots of this machine. Fatso, is it? I'd choose your last words more carefully if I were you. What's that? Who's there? Any last requests? Nearly there! I'm almost safe! I think not. Yeah, giant claptrap! Though we never see one in the game- Though we never see one in- in actual gameplay. Anyways, welcome to Creepy Castle! Okay, let's go get Donkey. As you can see, this area has a bottomless pit to it. So yeah, you fall off that pit, you're dead. You die. Uh, come on, let me let me up. Thank you. Let us up. Nothing over here. Now, as far as Donkey Kong 64 levels go, they pretty much saved the best for last when it came to this one. Okay, just lots of Donkey. So yeah, let's go grab, and then we'll make our way back here. Okay. Let's go. Okay, we're almost in the main hub of the, of the level. Okay. You know what? Screw it. I think it would be best for us to just jump off. Okay. Yeah, if you're going to this level, just start off with Donkey Kong. It'll make things a lot easier for you. Okay. Okay, Donkey, we'll start with you. Doot, a root, doot, doot. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, let's go. And watch how we fall off this bridge. This rickety bridge that will fall apart at any second. It looks like it could fall down with just a strong gust of wind. Okay, let's head up here. Okay, final barrel mini, final barrel blast mini game. Okay, we have to go through all the rings. Okay, this will be the last thing for the episode. Okay. Perfect. OK. 
Okay, another one. Okay, should do a restore point in front of that one. Okay. Boom. Okay, there. Okay, create the resource point. We don't need that one near the near the crusher. Sorry, near the Brabbit. Okay. Great. Okay, there we go. There we are, and... There we go! Okay, let's go in this tree. Okay. Coconut gun, fires and spurts. If you go into this area, it's gonna be a dungeon. Okay, there's DK's final. Okay, DK second to DK's penultimate crusher. Okay. Boom. Okay, got the blueprint. Okay, another balloon. Okay, what's in here? Okay, let's grab these crystal coconuts because they're here and we can. Okay, let's see what's down here. It should be another banana, though then again they may say, oh hey, you got the blueprint, so that is a banana in of itself. That's just a, that's just a golden banana but with extra steps. Okay, there's the banana. Okay, and... Come on. Come back here. I know, no. I did not mean to click the camera. Okay. Okay, come on. Okay, come on. Okay, are we seriously out of range? I think we're at, I think we need to get the weapon power for this area. Okay, come on. Stop taunting me with your fluttery nature. Okay. Yes. Oh, come on! It was right there! I pressed it as soon as the B button appeared. Uh, no! Okay! Come on. Ah, uh, darn it! This camera is just, this camera makes me sad sometimes. There! Okay, one banana fairy. Okay, we just have one more banana fairy. We just have one more banana fairy to go.
Okay, I think that we're going to need... I think we're going to need the weapons upgrade for this level. But anyways, I think now would be a good time to end things off. Anyways, I really appreciate that you took around to watch this episode. You're a great viewer, and I hope you come back for the next one. If you like this video, like, subscribe, comment, share, do whatever that you want. We'll see you next time. Bye.